Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. In today's video we're going to be taking a look at Event Viewer which is built into Windows. To start off with all you need to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and type in Event and you should now have Event Viewer pop up. You now need to open this up and once it's open this is what you will end up with and basically with Event Viewer if you've been having any issues with your computer for example it's been turning off without giving you any notice or warning or it keeps restarting or blue screening or you're just having issues with security and software then all the Event Logs will be logged in here Basically, to start off with, all you need to do is go over to the left hand side and you will have Windows Logs. If you expand this, you will now have Application Security Setup System and Forwarded Events. This is where all the logs will be stored. If you have a problem with applications, then you would click in the application section. If you have an issue of security, you click in there. Or for example, if we have an issue of our system, like it keeps shutting down, or we keep getting a blue screen, then you would click into system. And straight away, as you can see here, I've had four errors appear. And they've all got the same event ID, which is 116. If I just click on this error, it will give me a little bit of information about the error, but down here is the most important part. For example, it says the event ID, and then it says the source. So if I go into Google and type in the source name, and then put the event ID in, it will tell me exactly what the problem is with this error, and how to fix it. Sometimes it might take a little bit of research, for example you might have to go onto like one or two forums and just read a little bit more about the error and how to resolve the issue. If we go back onto our main screen for the event viewer, you will see here a summary of all the events that have happened on your machine in the last seven days. And as you can see, we've had no critical errors, which is fantastic. They are normally the errors when your computer does just shut down without giving you any notice and you've been getting blue screens, which is, that's really good news. And I can tell you, I have not had any problems, touch wood, on my computer within the last seven days, which is nice. We've had 369 errors. And if I just expand that, we can see what those errors are. And here we've got Offent ID 13, and that's the source name. So I'll just put that in Google, and then I can resolve that issue. If we scroll down a little bit more, we've had a lot of warnings, which I can expand and just have a little look at all that. As you can see here, we've had 77 warnings on this Bits client. If we now just get rid of all this, um, just minimize it all again. Right, just before we finish up here, on the right hand side you have actions. Where you can open saved logs, you can create a custom view, which basically if I just click on there, you can create a new filter, which would go on the left hand side, and select what you want to be in that filter, or custom view. And also, we have import custom view, and we also have, which I love this feature, is connect to another computer, which basically allows you to view the event logs on another machine, which is running on the network. I must admit, I think that's a cool feature, and it's really handy. And unfortunately, that does bring us to the end of this video. I hope this video helped. If it did, hit the like button below, and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.